I'm a first-time delegate and a first-time speaker. Thank you. I'm representing the Ian Division in London and I begin my address in the name of the Most High. Assalamu alaikum. When certain politicians and the media use the term muscular liberalism, that's just another word for racism and Islamophobia. This stance on Islam has led them into primary schools to ascertain why young girls wear the hijab, as it could be interpreted as a sexualization of these young girls. I say shame on Ofsted for victimizing young girls, for choosing to wear religious articles of clothing. There is no such measure made for other religions, this imperialistic saviour thinking. And I am here to state for all people who choose to practice their beliefs openly that we are not oppressed by our faith. The Quran beautifully states, La ikraha fi din, which translates to there is no compulsion in religion. My faith has given me the right to choose 1,400 years before the Universal Declaration of Human Rights told me I could. The right to choose to wear their articles of faith. Seats wearing the turban, Jews wearing the kippah, or Christians wearing the crucifix. Practicing my right to freedom of expression through the hijab empowers me and other women like me to know that we are able to make decisions for ourselves. Through the hijab, women like me feel empowered to overcome the social expectations of sexualization that is relevant and has currently resulted in many cases of anxiety and worse. I can speak for myself and others like me. At school, I was able to focus more on the thoughts that were running through my mind than how good I looked to the world. The NUT has supported a woman's right to choose when it comes to pregnancy. I want conference to support my right to wear the hijab. I the law to choose between their faith and their education, their faith and their right to work in the public sector their faith and their right to enjoy a day out by the seaside with their families, oppressed groups, in particular mine, Palestine. Thank, thank you, you. Thank you, Latifah.